by winter with your white blanket that makes all borders disappear. Goodbye winter with your cold and fresh breath that awakens the soul while nature seems asleep. Goodbye winter with your crispy sound underneath my feet and your magical crystals glinstering in a ray of light. Goodbye winter with your invitation to rest and reflect. Because of you we appreciate the coziness inside our home. There is no time when my hot coffee or tea tastes better than after a walk within your cold landscape. Thank you winter. Hello spring. cliche but a cliche is a cliche for a reason right every time when spring comes I have the urge to clean my space up to declutter to rearrange stuff to um, make it as tidy as it probably isn't <laughs> for the rest of the year so and now that we are finally spring again I did clean up my studio space finally because it was way too cluttered and you have probably only seen this wall behind me <laughs> in my videos and pictures so far and um, my desk where I do my tutorials on and where I make my collages and stuff but now that I have cleaned up my space I can finally show you my whole studio room So, you are probably familiar with this wall, <laughs> you have seen that before, as well as my desk. So this is the wall where I hang my um, current paintings on and the paintings that I'm, that I'm working on are always um, visible this way for me and I can think about it and um, yeah, let them sink in if you know what I mean. So this is the weird table without legs situation, <laughs> which helps me to um, yeah, be able to get higher to, um, to the wall to, um, to hang up stuff. So, and this is the self-made desk. My microphone that I use to record voiceovers and um, songs. And now I can finally show you the other walls, <laughs> the other two, which is basically storage space, art books. Yeah, camera stuff is in that cupboard and lots of um, packaging material to um, send artworks, of course. And this wall is my huge physical idea, <laughs> idea and inspiration board made of cork. I, I dislike the, the white stripes on the top and the bottom so I might actually paint it um, in the same color as the cork. 